So you're considering a move to Covington, Georgia, thinking, well, this may be a great little area to settle down. Do not move to Covington, Georgia without knowing these five things. Okay, so if this is your first time to my channel, hey, I'm Nikia Warner, a local realtor, broker and owner of Pink Sands Group, helping families buy, sell, and invest in real estate for over 15 years. But enough about me. Are you ready to explore Covington, Georgia? Let's go. Let's talk about it. Number one, so where is Covington, Georgia? Well, it's about 35 miles from the city of Atlanta. Now, don't get too excited. That may sound like, ooh, just a 35 minute drive. Not quite. If there's traffic, that can actually be a 45 minute to a whole hour drive. There's almost always traffic. Gotta love it about traffic. Number two, what are the residents saying about Covington? So Covington has a population of over 15,000 people. It has always been said to have a small town feel. Well, that depends on who you ask. Many have felt that Covington's strong sense of community sets it apart from other areas. Residents, they take pride in their city and they actively participate in lots of community events such as festivals and the farmer's markets. Now, some residents that have moved here from other areas, well, they say that they have met some great people here and there's a sense of community and they absolutely love it. But others have said that it's just becoming too crowded to them. However, it doesn't have as much, it doesn't have nearly as much traffic as when you're in McDonald, Georgia trying to navigate I-75. Now, one person said, this one small town has been taken over by tourists. That takes us to number three. Number three, it is a film-friendly community. Covington has gained fame as a favorite filming location from popular TV shows like The Vampire Diaries to movies like The Dukes of Hazzard. Now, the city has welcomed numerous, numerous productions. Now, this unique attribute, well, adds an exciting element to the daily life. You know, it allows residents to witness the magic of entertainment and that industry all up close. You might even catch a glimpse of your favorite actors in action or in person. Or you may not like all that fuss and don't care about stars and don't care less about a celebrity or your traffic being diverted. Just depends on what you're looking for. It sounds pretty cool to me though. Number four, what can you get for your money in Covington? Well, let's just say, I know of a new construction community that's building brand new homes starting at, wait for it, $315,000. Brand new homes. That's some amazing prices. Beat the crowds to the cute community and call me today to get you in the door. Oh, and those are all four bedrooms. I'm telling you, don't miss out on these Covington prices. You see, one of the most enticing aspects of Covington is its affordable cost of living. You know what else I noticed about Covington? It's the amount of yard space you tend to get with your homes. Much better than what you get when you're in areas like close to Atlanta, in the city, or in like areas that are right close to the city. If you buy a home with a really nice yard and space and decide you want to build a pool, well apparently Earl Barn Concrete and Pools is the way to go. The locals say he's the best. I see it on Facebook and the groups all the time. They have great reviews. Now it's crucial to thoroughly evaluate your personal preferences and priorities when considering a move to any location. Factors such as job prospects, lifestyle preferences, and access to amenities should be weighed against the advantages and the disadvantages of any particular place to ensure you know it aligns with you, your individual needs, and your family needs and aspirations. You definitely need to get the best route in your corner. Contact me today to start your journey. Happy shopping!